all right hi guys so in this video i will be showing you guys how i am installing some clip-ins to my hair because i want to wear my hair straight so i'm going to try these clip-ins to see how it works so we are going to try these out hope you guys enjoy the video let's get started okay so this is how i slept with my hair <laughs> so let me kind of give you an idea what's going on here so i um put my hair in this is part of my leave out this is a braid here got one here there's actually four braids one here and then one here and <clears throat> see if i can separate it out again and so all of this and this and this is our leave out and then these are my braids and I just, I already pent them up because like I said, this is um, for sleep. So yes, <coughs> oh, excuse me. So um, I've already pent them up. So the braids are all down to my head as good as possible. I hope it works. <laughs> and then now we're just gonna untwist the leave out and we'll go ahead and flat iron just a little bit just barely on a mild setting right now I have it set at 300 and we'll see if I need to um, bump it up but I don't want to add too much heat to my hair if I don't have to you know so we're looking to do as minimal as possible okay so let's go ahead and I know I'm excited because <laughs> I've never um, had extensions or anything. So outside of, you know, like braids. So I'm excited, excited to do this. Actually, let's save the front for last. And let's do this part. All right. So I'll just let you guys watch why I... Do a quick little flat iron and then we'll start printing our clip ins. And I'm trying to hurry up because <laughs> yeah, okay, all right, all right, so let's get started flat ironing. And I already put like my heat protectors and everything in my hair. I did that last night when I did this. So hopefully we don't have any issues. <laughs> and if you guys been watching my channel, you know that right here in the crown of my head is the nappy part of my head. <laughs> And this is a new flat iron too, so that's why I don't really know what my setting needs to be. All right now I've got it on 320. And it didn't really do much. So I'm gonna bump it up to 360. Because my last flat iron, I was used to my setting, but this one is a little bit better, I believe, and so. I don't want to risk burning my hair. Okay, we're going to leave it at 360 for this because, like I said, we're just trying to make this leave out look, look appropriate. Okay. 
because I don't think it needs to be super, super straight. I don't know. I may go back over it. Let's just... This is really weird doing this. <laughs> oh, look at that gray. Look at that gray. Uh, my plan was to try to dye it a little bit before I did this, but I think it'll be fine. I'm seeing more and more people just say, forget it, and just wear their gray. So... I'm trying to not be so pressed over it. I think most people, you you tend to not have as much problem with it when it grows in pretty. <laughs> when it kind of grows in sporadic and weird, I think that's when it's, when you're kind of dying it all the time. <laughs> And mine's growing in sporadic and weird. But it's okay. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna go back over it again. I think I'm gonna let this do. Just because I don't wanna. my hair in the front gets really straight like I don't have a problem with getting the front straight and so I don't want to make it like too straight because it's kinky hair but I, and I also don't want to you know have too much heat but I think it's okay what you think? You think it's okay? I think it's okay. You guys think it's okay? <laughs> Guess it's like you'll you'll find out eventually. Wow. Okay, that's it. So that's my leave out, and then of course we'll touch it up with some gel. All right. So I used 360 heat. And let's cut this off because we ain't using them on here. All right, so let me get the hair ready and I'll be back. Okay, now the fun part. <laughs> okay, I've already shown the hair, so I'm not going to show it anymore. <laughs> um, and then I'll let you guys know how I feel about it later if I still liked, um, if the wear was good. I hope it is. All right, so let's see if we can figure out how to get this going. Um, let me grab my scissors. Okay, so now I will let you guys just kind of follow along with me. I'm going to show you this entire process. So if you're not interested in watching, you can definitely uh, skip through this. But I definitely wanted to show you guys the entire process because I watched, like I said, I watched a couple of videos before purchasing the hair. And one thing that I noticed was that um, there were some times that I was like, okay, now what happened? Or when I was doing mine, I was kind of like, well is this supposed to be like this or you know I, I was just kind of needing someone I guess to kind of help me 
you know, entirely through the process and not saying anything, you know, like all the other videos, of course, they got major views, but that was a piece for me that was missing. So I wanted to kind of add that in for you guys. But um, yeah, we're going to go through the entire process because I, like I said, I'm new to trying to do things like this to my hair. So um, this is really for people that find themselves in that same situation. Like they want to try these new styles, but they're not really sure how to go about doing it. <laughs> so yeah, um, that, this is pretty much what that is, but yeah. So let's get back to this. So basically what you have to do is just, well, they have the sizes, um, like the length of the hair on the packaging. What I found was that I just went, I started in the back, like everyone else did. And I just took the um, the hair off of the uh, package in the order in which it was, you know, coming off. I didn't try. To, I didn't change up anything. I took it off one at a time and just started in the back. And I put the two pieces in the back, um, and then I kind of just went two pieces on each row. Um, you'll, but you'll see. But I made it. You know, you want to pair it up. You know, one on each side of your head. But the hardest part for me with this was trying to determine, um, and par part in the background noise, I'm like doing my voiceover outside. <laughs> the hardest part for me though was trying to determine the best way to put to braid my hair down, um, and so that was for me. This I knew it was going to be the trial, and it was going to be a trial and error because I didn't know I wanted to braid it down the simplest way. I didn't want to make it real dynamic, just because for one I hate braiding my hair, and for two, um, this was just some clip-ins that I was trying out to see if I liked. So I didn't want to go through all the trouble. So for me, the way you braid your hair down is probably the most important aspect of this. Okay, so I'm trying to find like the perfect place to put the clips because I pent those darn plaits up. Maybe I shouldn't have pent them up. I may have should have just left them down. But whatever. Okay, that's probably better. Um Okay, so that was the three inch, and these are going to be the five inch. I hope I don't have these things where it looks too crazy. really know where to move it. Uh, this is the first try, so if it doesn't look right, I guess I can go back in and try to fix it. thing got stuck. Okay. All right, so this side. Seems like the pieces are just really long though. <laughs> I figured I'd show you guys an amateur with a weave doing this because, see, on that side, it don't look like that. Oh, let's see. Because I'm definitely an amateur. Amateur. <laughs> okay, maybe we can stick it right there. There we go. Maybe that's better. Okay. Let's 
Yeah, they got all kind of little stuff in here. Um, I need to bring my fan I'm about to burn up. Okay, let's try to here it is. Don't tell me this. This hair is already hot. <laughs> Let me get my fan. Hold on. <laughs> I know it's kind of loud, so I'm not going to keep it running, but right now I need to cool off. Auntie. Okay, I think I'm... Where am I at now? Right here. Okay. Alright, so I've only got two... Those are long pieces though. So I think I only got like three pieces left after this one. Okay. I'm gonna turn that off. Okay. I gotta put some music in this video too and maybe speed up some of this process, but I figured you someone might actually wanna see all of this occur. <laughs> It may be helpful. Maybe you can get yours and we can do it together. You know, you can tag along with me and put yours in while I'm putting mine in. <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, oh, goodness. That's what I want to call you. Come on. All right. I'll show you the back in a second. But I can't focus <laughs> to do that right now. Okay. And I don't know. This is the. Do I got two corners and stuff? This one's going to be in that braid. Yeah. We put that one in the braid. See that? Okay. It's, okay. It's doing something there. Is it? Maybe I'll cover it up. All right, keep going, keep going, keep going. That would be my advice. Keep going, don't get caught up too long on these things because it seems like you can do that easily. Um. Right, they got these things secured on here. Okay. <laughs> Didn't make any up. We're going to cut it off this time. I just <clears throat> have stuff falling everywhere. Now, I'm kind of worried. I only have these three pieces. I hope this is, because it seems like that's not going to be enough, don't it? Seems like I might have goofed up. I think I've got too many pieces. Um, in the back. I think I did that. I think I, took, I think I put too many in the back. I don't know. Because <coughs> after this one, I only got one more left. Um... Do 
did something incorrectly. Okay, let's look at some of this leave out. Okay, so, yeah, because it's not going to be right. This piece can't just be here like that again. getting um, anxious because it's the end and I'm not sure if this is right because I still got this piece to put on there and I don't know I have enough hair to even cover this up oh goodness don't tell me but I get to the end and I got a mess alright Okay, because I do, um, Okay, this one's gonna be kind of awkward. This seems like it's gonna look kind of cray cray. Huh? crazy <sighs> okay maybe we just need to let it be and then figure it out um, what is my leave out I probably should have straightened my leave out after I did this. You think that would have been better? Probably. See that piece? I can see that. Okay. How do we look? How does it look? Um, I feel like it's 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 doable. I've got to figure out. I think just how to get better at putting them in. It was the first time. For the first time, do you think I did okay? <laughs> I think it looks okay. Just this right here. That piece is nerving me because my hair is not covering it up. All right. Let's get some, let's get a brush and some gel and see what we can do to make this look a little better up in here. <laughs> All right, so, yeah, I should have did, do I drop this down some? Or... I keep messing with it. I mean, it looks like a piece is right there. I mean, which I don't care. I mean, my hair is actually longer than this thing, but that's neither here nor there. Um, 
I just want to be able to have a straight look sometimes and not have to <coughs> worry about my hair not holding because that's what happens all the time. My hair just does not do well in humidity at all. Dampness, humidity, none of the above. And so I, I have a hard time being able to wear my hair out um, in straight do's. And it bothers me sometimes just because, you know, you you do the natural thing, but you still want the flexibility of being able to, you know, wear your hair if you want to and that type of thing. So, that's kind of how it is for me. Like, I, I be wanting to wear my hair out, but I can't because it's just such a task. This piece ain't working for me, y'all. I think, <sighs> what am I doing wrong? I'm thinking I probably needed a more, more pieces or something. What you think? I think I should have moved some from the bottom. Maybe I put too much in the back. <clears throat> the other folks I watched do this seem to have had it a little easier. <laughs> um, see right there, you can still see here. Maybe I didn't take out enough leave out. What I'll do is I'll probably wear it like this for a few days and then take them out and do them over. But I don't want to take them out and do them over right now because I just put them in and it'll make me get frustrated. And so the second time will be worse <laughs> because I know this is not, this is not my thing. Like I have to figure, it takes me time to figure this kind of stuff out. Um. And so, that's kind of where I am, you know. This was the first time. First time, this is usually not going to be perfect. And so, we're just going off of that. That the first time is usually not going to be perfect. And I'm not going to stress myself over it. I feel like it's neat enough to pass. I mean, I work from home, so it's not that serious. I just be wanting to look presentable when I'm on camera. And I didn't want to go pay to get my hair braided right now because I just don't want to come off of that money right now. So, so when I saw these clipping options, I thought, girl, if you don't try that, because that will give you the opportunity to be able to wear your straight. No, that part's not straight. I like it though. I love the um, the look. I think maybe I do have maybe too much in the back. Maybe I can um, put more in the top next time. But I, 
I do like it. All right, girl. Let's put this some sheeny sheen on here. Uh, I was going to put some more on. I was going to put some more um, heat on my hair, but I'm not. I think I need to leave it be before I mess around and damage my hair. Even though it's just little pieces, it's still, I don't want to damage them. All right. So, girl, what you think? What you think, girl? I'm happy because now I can wear my hair straight sometimes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, not my hair. <laughs> this hair. Okay, so let me know what you guys think. Um, and you can definitely leave me any suggestions. And I think the main things that anyone would probably say that knows about this hair or, or knows about putting extensions or whatever in, I'm sure you're probably going to tell me that I put too much in the back. And that's fine because I'm thinking that that's what I did. But it was my first time. So, you know, you're going to run into problems on the first go. It should only get better with each time. But I do think that this is going to start being like a go-to thing for me is clip-ins because I do like this. Yeah, I like this a lot. All right, guys, so let me know what you think. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope it wasn't um, too long and boring. Um, I tried to talk throughout the whole video, but I know sometimes you get caught up in what you're doing. Yeah, so... Mm -hmm. So let me know what you guys think. Um, oh, let me turn around so you can see the back. Uh, I haven't looked at the back yet, so I hope it's not bad. <laughs> you guys look at it first. Y'all got to see the back first. <laughs> All right. So anywho, um, hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. <laughs>